Yeah, so this week we're running a fully inclusive camp for children with physical and um, intellectual disabilities. So we've aged it from between 6 and 16 years of age. So thankfully it's gone so well um, so far this week and uh, the kids are really engaged in all the activities and all the entertainment and it's been a huge success so far. There's a huge level of need obviously for each, for each child. Each, each child is, qu is quite unique so uh, staffing is, is a huge importance to the success of the camp and uh, thankfully our, our staff are, have been great so far and the kids uh, due to this reason have had such a, such a good time and um, as you can see from all the, the, the activities this morning, the Zumba and the Magician, um, it's just been brilliant and it's so uh, rewarding and um, self-fulfilling uh, to see them having so much fun. Yeah, so I suppose like everything, all the kids, they enjoy their sporting activities so we, we, we've been able to have the school hall for, for lots of sports activities from our basketball and our boccia and our, and our soccer as well so um, apart from the entertainment like the uh, Magician and uh, we had uh, Zumba obviously and we had uh, an entertainment group in yesterday, superhero entertainment group in yesterday um, and then tomorrow we've got a mobile pet farm arriving to Stuart so that'll be interesting and again all the kids love animals and uh, so it was something we, we, we planned in advance of their, of their coming to Stuart's. Yeah, it was great. It was great to get the help of the lads, obviously Kieran and Michael Dara. I'm sure they've got lots of important things to do, especially this week, the week of the big game. But to be able to put themselves out there to help me and to, to, to help the kids and uh, just give them even 30 minutes at a time is massive. And it's um, great credit to them and really thankful to them. And it's something the kids will, will remember for a long time. Yeah, it's, it's great. Look, everyone is back. There's 36 in the panel now at the moment and 36 fit lads, which is exactly where you want to be at the start of the year. Um, so it's a credit to everyone involved, from Brian Cullen and the kind of strength and conditioning side of things and the physiotherapists and everyone. So everyone's fighting fit and, and raring to go for Sunday. Yeah, really looking forward to it. Obviously, it's a big challenge coming our way now on, on Sunday, but it's certainly something we enjoy this time of the year in a full house in Croke Park and against a really good team in Tyrone. So I'm uh, just really looking forward to 3.30 on, on Sunday and uh, hopefully we can have a good performance and, and get a good win.